What has Coach been emphasizing in practice this week as you get ready to take on a strong Snyder team? A uh, big thing is just doing the little things right. Obviously, they like to run the ball. They're a really run-heavy team. So we just got to group tackle and just play with that physicality all game, win the line of scrimmage, and like I said, do those small details right as a team. You know, looking at your guys, I mean, we're about halfway through the season. What sort of identity do you feel like this Carroll defense has created through four games so far? I think we've done a great job as a defense. I think we've learned to come together as brothers and as a team and really just know like when it's the most important, we need to get a stop, it'll happen. And I think it's been uh, something that we've learned to do as the season's gone on. Uh, of course, a huge game on deck on Friday. Just how do you handle a, a game of this magnitude, just knowing this could go a very long way in deciding who wins the first SAC A division title? Yeah, I think uh, the biggest thing is just not getting nervous and just staying locked in all week. Obviously, you want to uh, be ready for the game, but you also want to have a little bit of that anxiousness because that's what gives you that fire, but you want to have it controlled. And I think that's just a big thing we've been making sure is that we have that controlled anxiousness, that we have that fire, and we're just ready to play. Uh, Friday, this is going to be our Highlight Zone Game of the Week, of course, a game that a, a lot of people have looked forward to. Just what are you looking forward to the most when you roll up to Spooler Stadium on Friday? I mean, I'm excited to see all the fans out there. I know a lot of the guys on the other team, too. I'm excited to go against my friends and just have a great time out there overall. I know it's always a great time playing a good team like Snyder.